What is up guys, in today's video I want to go over really quickly how to turn your iPad into a second monitor for your MacBook. And the reason why I'm making this video is because I have a 2017 MacBook Air and I just found out that I can't use Sidecar. And if anyone doesn't know what Sidecar is, Sidecar is just this feature that Apple provides. Um, and what it does is it seamlessly turns your iPad into being a second monitor for your MacBook. But if you have an older device like me, or your device isn't, uh, or is behind kind of what is listed here on your screen right now, then you unfortunately cannot use Sidecar. So the workaround that I found online was to use this app called Duet. And I like Duet because a lot of the reviews I read online were really positive. And on top of that, it says on their website that it was developed by ex-Apple engineers. So that kind of gave it this reliability factor for me. And when you compare it to the other stuff online, it seems like it's the closest to being like Sidecar. And so I also couldn't find very many negatives, but the one major downside is that it does it is pretty pricey. So just to be able to download the app, you're gonna need to spend $20. And on top of that, that $20 only gets you the base level plan, which requires that you connect your computer with the iPad using some type of cable. And that cable is obviously going to set you back some money. And now if you don't want to use a cable, you can upgrade to their Duet Air plan, which is going to cost you $20 on top of the $20 download fee. And that just allows you to not use the cable and connect your iPad with your computer uh, using Wi-Fi. And you could also go up a level to the Duet Pro subscription, which is $30 per year. Um, and that gives you wireless plus additional features. I don't think that those are necessarily worth it because in situations where you're not, you don't have Wi-Fi, you won't be able to use your dual monitor setup. Um, and so the cable you need is a USB-C cable that's Apple certified. The one that I'm using is the one you see in your monitor right now. It's called the Triplite USB Type A to Type C cable. And I got it from Best Buy for $13. Maybe you can find something cheaper on Amazon. But I would say when you buy stuff from Amazon, especially cables, just be just really read the description to make sure that it does what it's supposed to do. Um, I recently bought a cable and it didn't work um, because I didn't read through. But anyways, uh, just the first thing you're going to need to do to make this whole thing work is download the desktop app from their website and then go over to the App Store and then you download the Duet Display app. And once you have both of those downloaded, you're just going to have to, um, you all you're going to do is just open them both up in your computer as well as on your iPad and then you're going to take your connector cable if you're uh, if you're just using the base plan if you're using wireless you won't you can maybe skip the step but you take your cable and then you're going to connect your computer with your iPad and it is literally as easy as this and once you connect your iPad you just wait for a couple seconds and then your screen is going to go black and then before you know it you are going to have two monitors that work just like any other dual monitor setup and so i was really blown away at how fluid this whole kind of experience is i was expecting lags and glitches but really nothing um, and all the mac shortcut keys still work uh, the three finger slidey thing still works um, even command space and then searching for stuff that still works uh, moving windows from both displays it's completely smooth um, so yeah I hope this helps helps some of you guys out and if you like this video please leave a like and some uh, thumbs up and some comments and if you want to watch more videos like this in the future uh, please subscribe thank you so much and uh, yeah see you guys around bye